In this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix the communication error when using move to iOS on your Android phone and iPhone. So when you're trying to move data from an Android phone to iOS and after you put in the code from your iPhone, you might get an error saying that cannot communicate uh, with the device. So an error Maybe something goes like cannot communicate with the device, so it shows up here. So I'm just going to show you how you can fix the problem. The the main reasons why it's not working has to do with the Wi-Fi on the iPhone. So I'm just you can see there it said cannot communicate with the device. So what you want to do is on your Android phone, tap on the home key, then swipe down and press and hold to the Wi-Fi button. And on your Android, on your um, iPhone, make sure that so make sure that you tap on the back key, then tap on Move Data from Android, and then on your so tap on Continue. Once you see the code on your Android, quickly swipe down to refresh the Wi-Fi network. And now you can see the there is a Wi-Fi, a temporary Wi-Fi network that is uh, issued from the iPhone. Tap on that. And you need to put in the password. The password is exactly the same as the name of the network. So it will be um, I capital O capital S space. So you need to include a space as well. And then 812ED and tap on connect. Now remember it is case sensitive. And if there is a space, you need to put in a space. If there is no space, don't put in the space. So it needs to be exactly the same as the Wi-Fi name. So whatever it is there, you put it into the password. If there is capital case, you put in capital case. If there is a space, you put in the space. And also you have to be quick. If you take too long, then uh, the Wi-Fi is no longer there and then you have to do it again. So you can see here, this one is taking a while. So maybe the Wi-Fi has been switched off. And uh, that means you're going to have to do it again. So if it is switched off, I'll do it again. And I won't talk too much so I can uh, concentrate on uh, uh, putting in the password so that I, we can uh, immediately connect to the Wi-Fi on the iPhone. So at this point, it's, it's, it is uh, taking too long. So I think there is an issue. So I'm just going to tap on the back key here. And we try again. So move to Android and then tap on continue. So this time we have to be quick. I O S space four C D six six and connect. So again, you have to be quick. Once you do that, you can see the internet may not be available. So ignore that. Go back to iOS. So go back to iOS. So go back to the app. Move to iOS and put in the code now. So you can see nine one nine nine. For two, and if we put in the correct code, you should go past that error now. So again, the reason it's not working before is because uh, I'm busy talking to you guys, and uh, if you are quick, if you are quick, then you should get past uh, that troubles. So make sure once you are connected to Wi-Fi, you have to be quick. If you're not quick, you have to start again. And that's it. So that's how you can get past such um, error um, that you cannot communicate with the device. And uh, hopefully that can solve your problem and you will be able to transfer all your data from Android to your iPhone. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. I'm just going to tap on done to finish. And that's it. Thank you.